Welcome back, folks, to SmackDown Saturday. I'm Samurai TX, and the last time we left off, Ken Shamrock did defeat the Big Show in the singles match on SmackDown. Then at SummerSlam, The Undertaker did become the new WWF Champion by Tombstone and Triple H, and by winning by a knockout. So, there is a new WWF Champion, and we are going to begin Season Mode in Week 2 of SmackDown Saturday. So let's get this show on the road. I'm excited to do this because I've been wanting to do this for such a long time and it's a, upon the horizon. And with WrestleMania season on the horizon as well, I will definitely be doing this for in the entirety of Saturdays. And this week in SmackDown, AJ Styles literally beat the snot out of Shane McMahon, sending his head through a car window. Um, the, pa the passenger's window, anyway, at the back seat of a car. But Shane McMahon did uh, propose a match. Well, AJ Styles said he didn't have an opponent, so Shane McMahon kind of said, Well, he's got an opponent now. Shane McMahon is one crazy dude. We've already known that if you watch wrestling from the year 2000s. Plus his, his crazy jump in WrestleMania last year against The Undertaker in the Hell in a Cell match. Yes, Shane McMahon's pretty damn crazy. So let's do some season mode, and let's start new because we've not done season mode. The people in orange are currently champions. And we are going to be Ken Shamrock, because we're currently rank 12. So we're going to try and rank him up to number 1 to be the WWF champion or Intercontinental champion. Either way, we will be changing our character uh, down the line. But for now we're going to stick to being the world's most dangerous man, Ken Shamrock. And we start at a house show in April 2000, weeks after WrestleMania, no less. So let's start the match. Let's see the match card first. Mark Henry vs. Dino Brown, Christian vs. Hardcore Holly, Big Show vs. Big Boss Man, Al Snow and Mankind in a Battle Royal, Baruch vs. Bubba Ray Dudley, Ken Shamrock in a full count anywhere match against The Godfather, and then a three um, triple threat match for the World Wrestling Federation Women's title in the main event on a house show between Tori, China, and Debra. Let's start with Mark Henry vs. D'Lo Brown, and D'Lo Brown pins Mark Henry. Christian vs. Harko Holly, win for Christian. Big, big Show, Big Boss Man, House Snow, Mankind in a Battle Royal Elimination Match. And it's a win for Mankind. Farouk vs. Bubba Ray Dudley. There's a win for Farouk. And it's now Ken Shamrock vs. The Godfather in a Falls Count Anywhere match. So without further ado, let's get this match on the road. And it's making his way to the ring from Sacramento, California. Weighing 255 pounds, he is the world's most dangerous man, Ken Shamrock! And here he is, making his way to the ring with a scream of motivation as he's ready to take on this man. Train. Right as the Godfather. He was also Papa Shango in the past. Man, this guy was well over back in the day. Godfather, Al Venus, D'Lo Brown, Steve Blackman, B um, Al Snow, all the mid-carders were somehow over. And the heels were hated. That's one thing I liked about back in the day as well. And we are starting. Well, they were making their way to the ring, but apparently we start now at the um, parking lot. It's a false count anywhere, match, so anything happens here. As Ken Shamrock is now brawling with the Godfather at backstage. Wow, this it, it, this is not a way to um, warm fans up for the triple threat main event match between the ladies. I don't know what is. And Ken Shamrock clubs Godfather to the back of the head. And then tries to go for the angles, but Godfather immediately gets up from that. Godfather counters. Ken Shamrock punches Godfather in the face of the counter. Belly to belly suplex. And Ken Shamrock locks in the arm bar. Godfather's in the world of trouble here. But he backs away and retreats. Hard scoop slam on the concrete floor. That's gotta hurt. Oh dear. Ouch. Um, I forgot that move's name. I might remember it down the line. But let's turn on the move's name, sorry. Let's turn on the move names. Pretty sure it will be there. Horikarana by Ken Shamrock. Ken Shamrock will do now the spinning heel kick. Uh, that miss 
But he does the belly to belly suplex. And now he's going to do the dragon screw. He's going to target that leg of the Godfather. And he is, because he's got the ankle lock locked in. Will the Godfather tap out here in this Fool's Count Anywhere match? No, he doesn't. Spinning wheel kick or heel kick, and he missed, but he's going for the dragon screw again. It is a Fool's Count Anywhere match. Angry stomp by Ken Shamrock. But he's once again targeting that leg um, with the dragon screw. And he's about to lock in the ankle lock. Oh, the Godfather tap out. Ken Shamrock really is uh, working on that leg. I think he's going to pin Godfather, but I don't think he wants to. He just wants to snap his ankle. Oh dear, what an attack. The club to the head. Ken Shamrock counters and then does the belly to belly suplex. Godfather gets up immediately from that. Ken Shamrock exchanging kicks, but Godfather counters and throws him to the ground. Does the pin for one. Ken Shamrock kicks out at the count of one. And then he does a scoop slam. Good scoop slam by the Godfather, but Ken Shamrock gets up. Does the belly to belly. Now he's locked in the arm bar. The arm bar. Will Godfather tap out? No, he won't. Oh, counter. Counter. And the uh, Manhattan drop. Ouch, that's gotta hurt. And the knee stop. Ouch. And Shamrock does a spinning wheel kick. Now he's gonna pick up the Godfather. Nope, he's got kicked in the face instead. Oh, Ken Shamrock does the Horikarana. Godfather is down. Ken Shamrock's gonna pick him up. But Godfather is gonna counter again. It's the belly of belly suplex. Godfather really is in the world of trouble here. And Shamrock has locked in the ankle lock. The ankle lock. Will Godfather tap? It is Wolves Count Anywhere match. Will he tap out? Not to reason. No. Well, it is a Fool's Count Anywhere match, and Ken Shamrock's going for the pin. One, two, two and this match is over! What a, what a win for Ken Shamrock, and the statement set. And Ken Shamrock now goes back to the ring to celebrate. What? Why didn't they celebrate that backstage? Oh well, Ken Shamrock somehow made his way to the ring to celebrate the fans! In Los Angeles, in Los Angeles. Right, so now we're going to the main event for the Women's Championship. And we're going to skip it. And Deborah is the Women's Champion. So Tori loses her belt. What a shame. So May 2000, we are on SmackDown. And let's start these mum's events. Val Venus vs. Steve Blackman. It's a win for Val Venus. Hello, ladies. Ken Shamrock vs. The Big Boss Man. So Ken Shamrock... Is having a non-title match against the hardcore champion. Let's get the show on the road. Here he is, the world's most dangerous man, making his way to the ring, as he has a match against one of the more dangerous people in the Big Boss Man. Ken Shamrock is ready to psych himself up as he screams out loud. Ken Shamrock is known for getting himself disqualified sometimes. I love this feat, by the way. And here he is, the hardcore champion, the big boss man. He was feuded with Al Snow, but right now, Al Snow is at the back of his mind as he has to worry about the world's most dangerous man, Ken Shamrock. So he's got his hands filled tonight, as he's got an angry Ken Shamrock. Who just wants to beat people up for the fun of it? Chop. Oh, what well, an uppercut and an elbow drop. Ken Shamrock's immediately up and does the belly to belly suplex. Sorry about the slowdown. It will tend to do that often, sometimes. It's a dragon screw by Ken Shamrock. Spinning heel kick. Chop missed. Close light. Oh, double axe handle. Big Boss Man is throwing him in the corner. Austin punches. That's what they call it anyway. Big Boss Man smacked his head off the um, turnbuckle. And he's already in the arm point and we're in trouble. He's going to back away from Ken Shamrock to try and get some uh, breathing space. But Ken Shamrock's not going to give him that breathing space. He's going to punch him in the face. Low kicks. Ken Shamrock counters that punch. Does a German suplex. One. And Big Boss Man kicks out at the count of one. Ken Shamrock is going to focus on his leg. He's going to try and make him tap out. As he does a dragon screw, then the Horikarana. 
man, these, these, they don't sell much off in this game. And big boss man throws Ken Shamrock in the ropes, and he's limited, knocked him out of the ring with that um, double axe handle. Ken Shamrock spends his time outside the ring, but he's in the ring immediately at the count of one, as he just wants to beat up the big boss man. It's the dragon screwed up by Ken Shamrock to the big boss man. Now Ken Shamrock is going to lock at the angle of, will the big boss man tap out? Will he tap? Ken Shamrock has the hardcore champion in the angle lock, but he's not going to tap out here. I don't think Ken Shamrock has done enough work on that angle, and I don't think the big boss man was ready to tap out just yet. Another dragon screw by the uh, former Intercontinental champion, Ken Shamrock. And the big boss man counters with a few punches. Then does the sidewalk slam. Ken Shamrock with the German, but he has to break it up because uh, Big Boss Man uh, did reach the ropes. Now he's clubbing Big Boss Man to the back of the head. Now he's going to lock in the ankle lock again. The ankle lock is locked in. Will Big Boss Man turn out? Will Ken Shamrock submit the hardcore champion? And he does! Nice victory by Ken Shamrock. And he celebrates in front of the um, Chicago, Illinois. I think I said, I think I said it wrong. Is, is, is it Illinois? My pronunciation kind of sucks for American states. But sorry about that. Get Shabbat rings in front of Chicago. Ah. Right. Farouk and Bradshaw vs. Edge and Christian. Christian pins Farouk. And Tori has um, placed a rematch clause tonight against Deborah. And she regains the Women's Championship. Mankind vs. Al Snow. That's a bit for Mankind. And The Undertaker challenges, uh, Big Show challenges The Undertaker for the World Wrestling Federation Championship. And The Undertaker retains his World Wrestling Federation Championship. Now we go to the King of the Ring. Right, we're going to do King of the Ring, and then that's it for this um, Smackdown Saturday. What? Paul Bearer? You what? Why am I facing Paul Bearer? That's the easiest person I'm going to face yet. Oh, Bearer? What? Crazy! Paul Bearer's in the King of the Ring! He, he, I don't know what to say! I don't even think people, Paul Bearer has anything to say! He's kind of scared! They pull him in the ring with Ken Shamrock! Vince McMahon is out of his mind by putting Paul Bearer in the match with Ken Shamrock! Oh, Ken Shamrock is kind of crazy here! Paul Bear has made his way to the ring. Now we are waiting for the world's most dangerous man from Sacramento, California. Ken Shamrock. I'm just gonna make you guys listen to the theme while I just sit here quiet and wait. And here we go. And it's a snapmare by Paul Bearer. Paul Bearer's brave. Sleeper hold. Ken Shamrock's in trouble already with a sleeper hold. But Paul Bearer is going to regret putting Ken Shamrock in the sleeper hold as Ken Shamrock puts him in the dragon screw. Now he's just going to dominate by beating Paul Bearer for the fun of it. And Paul Bearer reverses and puts Ken Shamrock down and tosses Ken Shamrock. My goodness, Paul Bearer is actually putting up a fight here. But Ken Shamrock is going to counter. I think Ken Shamrock is not amused to be put in a match against Paul Bearer because he knows Paul Bearer uh, pretty much is not really the competition he seeks. Paul Bearer is actually putting up a good fight so far, but I'm pretty sure he knows how um, pretty much screwed he is actually. He's very screwed because he's facing Ken Shamrock with Snapman by Paul Bearer. He's putting up a good fight so far. Ken Shamrock counters with um, punches to Paul Bearer's um, stomach. It's a Horika run up by Ken Shamrock to Paul Bearer. And Paul Bearer is getting clubbed to the back of the head. My goodness, Ken Shamrock is not playing around as he locks in the angle lock to Paul Bearer. And Paul Bearer's foot is on the rope. Looks like he's going to have to break it up, Ken Shamrock. Or not. As the referee did not see it. Now Ken Shamrock is just punching Paul Bearer in the face. I don't think the um, World Wrestling Federation champion, The Undertaker, is pleased to see Paul Bearer get a beating of his life by Ken Shamrock. But. I'm pretty sure all the fans wanted to see Paul Bearer get beat up, considering Paul Bearer has interfered in many matches before. And um, he did um, interfere in a match with um, Stone Cold Steve Austin 
with The Undertaker uh, to become number one contender to be Triple H. So, I don't think uh, anybody's showing Paul Bearer any mercy. Don't worry guys, I just made that up off screen just to do some sort of feud needed to Undertaker's um, WWF title success in my first video. It didn't really happen in real life, but Paul Bearer did interfere in quite some matches, but I've just created my own storylines and whatnot, because this is my let's play, you know, I can do what I want. And Paul Bearer kicks Ken Shamrock in the face. And Paul Bearer counters Ken Shamrock, my goodness, very ambitious here. Eye rake, oh dear. A belly to belly suplex by Ken Shamrock to Paul Bearer. And now he's going to try and look in the angle lock, and he does. Paul Bearer is in a world of trouble, but Paul Bearer has got the ropes. Will Ken Shamrock let go? Let go of one, two, three, four, let go! And he does. Oh, Ken Shamrock actually did let go. I thought he was going to get himself disqualified there. Uh-oh. Right, Dragon Screw. Right, I'm going to, after this, after this first match, I'm going to call it a video. Because of the fact that, well, um, it's got 16 minutes. So why not to call it a video? Get up. Never mind. Swim in the ankle lock. And Paul Bearer is in a world of trouble here. Will he tap? The answer is... Yes, he does. Of course he will, because he's nowhere near the ropes. So Ken Shamrock progresses to the semi-finals. Let's press start. So when we come back, folks, let's skip all of this. There's no copy Xbox. Why is Undertaker and King of the Ring if he's WWF Champion? Oh well, don't mind. And Mankind is eliminated by the Big Show. When we come back, folks, we will have our semi-final match against Stone Cold Steve Austin and the King of the Ring. Until then, until then, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys next week for another episode of SmackDown Saturday. Stay tuned, everybody. Take care.